Hey guys, so today I'm just gonna make this uh, show to you know show you how to install the 4.1.2.1 ROM without any you know kind of restocking on your Galaxy Nexus. So as you can see, I'm running an uh, 4.1.2.1. Galaxy Nexus and AOKP ROM JB Milestone 1. So, I don't want to have this ROM anymore because it's kind of lagging. And I, I know there are some problems with the team and all, and all but I don't want to have this ROM and I want for the 2, yeah, on the upgraded version of Android. Always, as always. So, As you can see, first of all, you have to go to Play Store. Let me close up all that. As you can see, it's using so much RAM, and and I got you know, uh, once it was about six megabytes free, so that sucks. So now I uh, you should go ahead and. Type in goo uh, manager. As you can see over here, this app is pretty awesome. You should go ahead and download it. Then click open. Uh, first of all, check. F I'm gonna check for any updates that is available from my ROM, uh, which is not any update available. So then I'm gonna install Open Script Recover, Open Recovery Script. Yeah. Then yes. And there's a recovery from my phone. Torque recovery 2.3.2.1, which is the latest version right now. I'm gonna let it go and do its work. As you can see, it's downloading the, you know, recovery. So we're going to let it go and recovery has been installed so that could that's quite nice so as you can see when we reboot into our recovery of course the unlocked galaxy nexus awesome one with the awesome CDO case. I think it's from CDO. I'm not sure. Actually, I don't know what the case is, but it's pretty awesome. But I, of course, I broke it some parts. So, yeah, as you can see. Um, so as you can see I got the latest torque recovery and I got 78% of battery so I'm good to go and I'm gonna reboot again to the system so uh, I'm gonna pause this because I know who, uh, it wouldn't take that long but still I don't wanna waste your time so let it go oh it's actually done with that thing and this thing shouldn't take that long you know so I'm not gonna pause this <laughs> I thought uh, the Google logo will take too long to you know launch and uh, pass through because <laughs> yeah after using the Galaxy S3 uh, it's kinda hard for me to 
use this phone again because it's kind of you know slow for me after using the Galaxy S3 because as you do know I got the I already got the Galaxy Ace and it's a pretty shitty phone and it's rocking on Android for that holy sh yeah it's working on Android ICS 4.04 and it's performed pretty awesome I'm gonna make a review of that and uh, as you can see 4.04 ice cream sandwich so I'm gonna make a review of that pretty soon so let it go and so the booting is done man Oh my god, my games. So, just gonna open my app drawer. Um, it's actually quite, quite slow right now. Open Goo Manager. Uh, first of all, you need to download the file you know the firmware file uh, it's actually a zip file you don't need any kind of uh, you know toolkit to install it you just install the zip file it is deodexed and rooted I think it's it should be deodexed I'm not sure but it should be but it's actually pretty cool to don't you know use any kind of hard method just you know just install the zip file from recovery and of course if you don't if you don't have a custom ROM you can just use OTA updater from the system from the system settings of course because I don't have a, a, a stock ROM so I don't have that option so I'm just gonna do it with the cool manager and stop using the AOKP ROM with this kind of cool theme. And first thing I'm gonna tell you is I made a backup with the titanium backup over here, as you can see. And I uploaded to Dropbox, and I also made a backup of my Nova launcher which is over here I made a backup I also made a backup I have my chomp SMS which I'm using it as my daily you know kinda SMS app but of course only for the gags and necklace I also made a backup on this so I'm not losing anything and you can also make a backup with your recovery. I'm not sure what you call it, an Android backup or anything. You can just make a backup with your recovery and make a backup from a whole system. But I'm not gonna do that right now, and uh, because I'm not gonna use this ROM anymore. So the first thing you should do is, yeah, make a backup, install Open Script Recovery, and then you should open Google Manager, as you can see over here. You, I don't have any open apps. You should open Google Manager. Oh, my laptop went to sleep. I don't want it to sleep. I want to download the things that I want to download. So, uh, yeah, it's over here. Yeah, down. Uh, now you have to select the thing flash ROMs. And as you can see over here. I'm not sure if you can read it. Of course you can't because it, you know lighting, lighting and all oh, is not kind of nice. Let me pull on the brightness. Maybe do this. Yeah, adds it from another location. So I'm gonna add it from another location and. You know, I got it in my ROM folder. Of course, I downloaded it, and it is called Big 
see, I'm not sure what it is called, but you just press it and you will see it over here. SD card ROM BBVA Maguro. Of course, it should be Maguro because I got the GSM Galaxy Nexus OTA and everything, and it should be correct. And now, as you can see over here, I got the order and flash selected option. So, uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wipe my whole data. Oh my god, I'm gonna. Uh, and I'm gonna create a backup for it so just let me create my backup just I'm gonna pause this uh, for a while to you know name my backup because I'm gonna uh, put the camera at you know the floor just wait a second uh, uh, as you can see I already named it so it's quite nice to have the option to back up from here. Holy great backup! A OKP. Oh my god! A OKP is it okay for you? Yeah. So right now, I'm gonna. Press this button, name Flash. Oh my god. Flash it. Am I gonna do it? Yes. Yes. Yes, bro. Yes. Um, pretty cool phone, but it's all right now. And I'm gonna let it go. The, with this awesome recovery and you know app and Google Manager. Oh my! Holy shit! So I'm gonna do it manually because I couldn't do it. Backup enable. So I'm gonna enable system data boots recovery EF no not of them. So enable compression, use internal SD card because I don't have an external SD card. So, a fresh size. Holy shit. I don't have enough free space. So I'm not gonna make it back up. Sorry for that. <laughs> I'm sure I'm not gonna lose any data. If I lose, I'm gonna die because you know these are not my data. These are, of course, this is my phone. This is, this is you know, actually it used to be my phone. Now it's you know, kind of family member. Or am I sure to flash it? Oh, I didn't make it. I didn't actually wipe my data. So I'm gonna factory reset. Oh my god. Go back. Cache. Gal cache. Back. And now install, install this. Oh my god, I forgot to focus. Mm. And... Uh, yep, I'm gonna flash this. Oops. As you can see, error 4.2.1, gel bean, the version. Yeah, of course I said this. Oh my God! I again. I sorry for that. I again ran out of my phone memory. So, of course I'm using my phone to record this video. So, uh, it is kind of now kind of successful. Of course, it's the Dell Dexrom, Udex, 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 or the GSM Galaxy Nexus, 
wipe that wipe cash and double cash again I'm gonna do that again just for safety and I won't get any, any boot loops boot loops I reboot system man rebooting my system yeah my GSM Galaxy Nexus of course as, as I said not mine but it used to be mine around mine GSM Galaxy Nexus with this kind of cool with animation uh. oh yeah mm. kind of cool angle yeah <laughs> I just like to make cool angles and take videos but of course I suck in that you should know from if you were watching my videos and uh, don't forget to subscribe my channel um sorry for my um you know kind of um, sound which is kind of low right now uh, you, you can just feel free to um, you know turn up your speakers I can't uh, talk you know kind of loud right now um so feel free to uh, you know turn that volume thing over here as you can see just uh, keep it high and you're good to go to hear my voice yeah uh, so as you can see over here um, this is the Galaxy Nexus. I'm gonna make a review of the thing which I've installed right now. And of course, I'm gonna make a review of the ROM which I installed on my Galaxy Ace, which is pretty cool. And yep. So I'm gonna make this uh, for my review make these things for my review just connect to my Wi-Fi and all these things and have an awesome day right now and thanks for watching bye bye